Sorry that the last episode was so long. You know what? There we go. This is where I'm going to be. You better run for dear life. I don't even know what part this is. But I think I've been doing pretty super mega well. Maybe in this way. Haha, <sighs> you fool, you fell for the trick. Now stay here in this pit for security. How, humil How humiliating! I spent so much effort escaping, only to be captured again. There is only one way to escape for good. Ending my wretched life. I was right, that did happen. There we go. I always end up with three. Come on, guys. It appears that the effects of the milk have yet to wear off. You should have waited a bit long before sending into another dream. That was too dangerous. That was my bad. Anyway, go back to the DAC. Just make a ride up ahead. That should bring you back. I hope your first wolf didn't die in that dream. I hope you can handle a little death here and there. Let me just... Alright, I'm still on difficulty easy. Oh yeah, this one's safe. No, I don't know crap about Street Fighter. Right. Let's do this. Oh wait, Dream 4 analysis. No. Don't be alarmed. I know you were expecting an analysis, but this is more important. Listen, you are in danger, but I know your memory was wiped. If you are going to make it out safely, you must heed my instructions. First, I must explain the details to you. Read note1.txt. Got it, let's do that. Leroy. First of all, I must explain who I am. My name is Robert Flinston. I was once your next door neighbor. But anyway, I've disguised myself as a guard and hacked into the dream analysis chamber. One sec. Chamber's main computer. For you to fully understand what is going on, I must explain from the beginning. About ten years ago, Minecraft deal was a peaceful and happy place. Then suddenly, an asteroid crashed into our planet. The asteroid brought evil monsters to this world. They called themselves mobs. The mobs consisted mostly of zombies, but there were also spiders, skeletons, endermen, silverfish, blaze, and the most deadly creepers. The mobs of our have, the mobs invaded our planet, attempting to take it over, but the Minecraftians won't stand for this. We waged war against the mobs. The mobs attacked at night, killing many. The Minecraftians fought hard to protect this world from evil. The war against the mobs has been going on for the past ten years. About a year ago, our village filled Rick was invaded by them. You, Leroy, one of the best villager in our or the best warrior in our village. You fought hard to protect us against the mobs. You even managed to destroy their ship. But in the end, everyone in the village, including you and your parents, were captured and placed in a prison. You were the only one who managed to escape from their prison. But just as you were about to reach freedom, the mobs recaptured you. Seeing as Seeing you as too much of a threat, the mobs wiped your memory 
and place you here in the dream training facility. So you see, your dreams have not just been telling you how you are feeling, but they are telling a story, the story of your past. Now that you understand who you are, you must get out of here. I know it seems impossible, but there is a way. Believe it or not, you are actually in the mom's main base. The dream training facility is only a small part of the base. If you can escape, you can head to their prison area and free all of our vig villagers. Oh no, someone is coming. I must go. One more thing. When you go through dream, the dream number five door, you will reach the library. If you can jump well enough, you might be able to reach a chest placed high in the bookshelves. In that chest, you will find an axe. You may use that. You can use this axe to break wooden planks. All right. Strange. Let's activate Dream Five now that I have. Ah, dang nabbit! I already activated it, didn't I? Why does everything take two times? Time for dream number five. I believe that the effects of the milk have worn off. Just pass through the library. Dream simulator for dream number five is past the door. Don't dilly dally, the books aren't interesting anyway. It's just a collection of books from a village we just. I mean, saved? Yeah. Alright, saved. Alright, so parkour. I'm really good at parkour. Why is it, though, so many maps when they do parkour, there's always a library for the parkour in it, you know? It's like, don't the librarians have better things to do than make sure people aren't getting hurt in parkour? No, no, no. Oh, darn it. Ugh. Dang it. Alright, look. Let me just say. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Maybe it is supposed to be up there. No, no. Ow! Oh. I'll see you guys once I get up there. I have a good feeling about this one. Ow! Let's try that again. Darn it. I kind of lied when I said I'd meet you guys once I get up there. You guys are going through this with me, too. Maybe not. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Let's do this.